Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, first, let's start with an apology. It's been a month. <laughs> it's been a flipping month since I've uploaded, but I had a chest infection that knocked me out for about a week and a half. And then because it's getting warmer outside, I'm getting a lot more clients. So that's my excuse. <laughs> but anyway, I'm back with hopefully a bang. Um, it's a new lens and you guys know, get a new lens and make a video. It's the Tamron 15 to 30. F2.8, there's a bunch of other letters and stuff in there. It will be on the screen, so you know you guys can see it for yourself. And I went to central London for once, not Tower Bridge, so that deserves a like in of itself. But yeah, let's just get straight into the content. Hey guys, welcome back to another POV. Um, it's a nice rainy day. I've wanted to shoot in the rain for a long time, and I've finally been blessed with some rain. I'm off to meet um, a few other creatives. That's Kevin, Leon and Jet. But on the way, let's see if we can cook something up. So I think the point of today is going to be, I'm going to just stick to using a wide. So I've got a Tamron 1530 on. And I just really want to get these shots utilizing reflections. Leading lines. Well, That's a cool one. I might get a bit closer because I love that distorted look and use this bigger reflection. But yeah, as I was saying, I've got a Got the camera on 15 to 30 on. Look at that bit of glass. So I finally got myself a wide angle. So I've covered all my bases pretty much. I've got a wide, I've got my 2470, and I've got my 105. So I'm having a lot of fun with this lens. So you'll see today, because I've got a wide and I want that distorted, well, wide look, I'm going to be utilizing a lot of reflections and leading lines because I do believe that in London using a wide with a leading line is just super 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 cool Leon, Kev, Jet just waiting for them to finish up their time lapse for POV but yeah we're currently up on one new change I'm just waiting for them to finish because hopefully it starts raining again it stopped and just kind of bummed me out but yeah Get a simple one of St. Paul's. Boom. Leon Simpson, say hello. Oh, what's going on? Okay. But first, I'm going to get a picture of that sky. Because that looks crazy good. Look at that. I'm going to do that in landscape just because. Ooh, actually. That is such a clean shot. It's nice, isn't it? Oh, that one's much better. It is. I like the silhouettes of the people. Yeah, same. This look up shot here, I've done on 24, but I've never done on this lens, obviously, because it's new. So what I'm going to do, because it's stabilised, I can afford to drop the shutter speed quite a bit, wait for them to overlap. Boom, clean as you like. And also, come to the middle of the stairs, get a bit more of a dynamic shot. Look up, boom. So those two shots on the screen. I'm gonna try throwing a bit of a moody orange edit on these. Like, a, almost like a Batman themed one. Because this sort of shooting environment really, really suits those tones. Can't be a good cook now. Or... 
भी फ्यूल है That's what you see when you walk into heaven. That is heaven right there on the table. This is worth more than M&S's stock. <laughs> there we go. Let's get this shot of St. Paul's. Nice and wide. Go for samples. Get lower, get the foreground in. Boom. Get a shot of safe pools. But over Jet's camera. Boom. See what, what's going on in this reflection? Oh, mate. You get literally the whole, you get the whole scene. Oh, for real? Yeah. Probably long expose this. Okay, we know after you take the shot, just stay still, yeah. So what I'm gonna do is I've got Kev just up ahead. He's trying to get a long expo. So I'm gonna use the reflection. I'm gonna use the leading line of the curve, him as a subject, and get this double decker bus going past. Go. Again, but rather than reflection, just use this leading line. Two bus. There's also a reflection here in a puddle. So I'm at 15 mil. Uh, let's change the settings before I take a long expo. Quite like this composition there. So in case no one knew, in one new change, there's this bar downstairs and if you look up you get a ridiculous symmetry shot. Position your camera up. It looks so good on wide. It, it, looks, it looks so good oh, when it's wider. Yeah, I went, I went, I went landscape over in this, so you've got oh, these did you? as well. I get you. Can. This middle portion, middle reflection, one, two, three. So I've got three variations of the same sort of area. What's yeah. stepping on? Don't litter, guys, because I almost died. Do not litter. Just get someone in there. Probably seen this shot, everyone's gotten some variation of it. Um, I haven't done it on my wide yet, so I was thinking maybe now would be a good time. So, there we go, not bad. Do you mind modeling for me? Not at all. Gonna get a jet here. Thank you. Reflection. How's it looking here? It's empty. Mate, that Ooh. looks sick. Fuck that yeah. is the reflection. <laughs> Get a bus across. It's massive. So Jet, I said we should use this puddle. Do it that way. Because you get a clean reflection of Bus, all yeah. these buildings and the buses. So that's what we're going to try next. All right, now we're just waiting for a bus. This is what street photography is about. Oh, bus. Yes! Oh, go, bus, bus, bus! Ugh. 
Oh, of course, a taxi came as soon as I picked my camera up. <laughs> Fuck's this sake. This one was there, man. Oh. It's alright, I got... I got a good shot. I'm happy with that. Fifty mil. Yeah, 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 boss. You will just have your taxi, though. Look. Whoa, that's nice quality, boy. Thank you, brother. Yeah. Take care, yeah. Thank you. Just taxis and taxis and taxis. What do I do? What do I do if not take shots of them? You know what I do? I take shots of them. That's what I do. Just look at that GoPro. Look at that. Look at those buildings, the lights, the puddles. Yeah, bro. Time to look up. As we always do. Should be able to. What I'm gonna do, there's four openings. I'm gonna go right into the middle. Drop my eyes off. enjoyed i'm making the conclusion straight after the intro just because like always i forget my thoughts on this lens i'm very very like very very happy with my purchase because it's a newer wide angle lens i was looking at the canon 16 to 35 mark ii but because it was released so long ago it's just not as sharp as these newer even third party lenses but yeah i'm very satisfied with it i sort of completed my trinity got this, I've got my 2470, then I've got my 105, maybe a 70 to 200 in the future, I don't know. Yeah, I cut it so I could wear a hat because um, my hair was just really annoying me. So I want to say thank you to everyone that was in this video, check them out down below, just won't be disappointed. Pretty much everyone I feature on my channel, the London creators that I work with, they're just amazing creators. So yeah guys, I'm going to try my best to get another POV out next week. Hopefully it's raining because I'm, I keep looking over here because there's a window. Rain's been forecasted all week and I know in this video I said it was raining but it stopped when I met the others and today was meant to be pouring it down. I was going to get the content today but looking outside the window it was literally just sunny. So it's either going to be a rainy POV or a POV with this. It's a little point and shoot my brother got when he went to Turkey. It's a 20 to 1200 digital zoom but it's 2.8 at 20. So I'm really curious to try this out. So whether it rains or not, I'm gonna have a good time. But as always guys, if you like the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Comment if you have any ideas that you wanna see, leave a like, and yeah, I've been Imaz Vision, and I'll see you guys in the next one.